Hey guys, so for this video today, I am going to be doing a video on how to get natural curls with no heat at all. This is how they will turn out and I think they are perfect and so pretty and I think they look so much like the wand makes them look. So I hope you guys enjoy this video and also if you want to know my hair care routine, get this video to 150 thumbs up and I will make a hair care video so I hope you guys enjoy okay so for the first thing if you just got out of the shower then your hair is probably gonna be really wet so you are either going to towel, towel dry it if you like to towel dry it, towel drying makes it a lot more frizzier so if you don't want it frizzy then you probably shouldn't towel dry it but Towels give me headaches, so I only wear them for like 10 minutes and let it naturally dry for the rest of the time. So I towel dried it at first, because here's my towel, and now it's kind of still like wet-ish, and I'm just going to let it get to where it is really wet up here and down here, and then pretty dry-ish, like just a little tiny bit damp right here and then I will show you what to do once I get to that. Okay so I just brushed out my hair and now all the knots are out so I don't I won't have any knots and you are going to need two clips. I'm going to actually show you a few different ways to do this so you can either use the clip one or you can use ponytails so I will show you these several ways to do it. So what I'm going to start off doing is I'm going to take my bangs because my hair is pretty layered and I'm going to twist my bangs into the rest of my hair like this and just keep doing that until I get all of the hair from the back. I split my hair into two parts so that it's like this. So I'm just going to twist it all the way to the bottom or wherever you want your curls to start and end, you can do that too. If you have naturally straight hair and you want the bottom to be curly, then you can just like put a ponytail right where you want it to not be curly. Like from if you wanted like the top to be straight and then the bottom to be curly, then just get the bottom of your hair damp and then let this part be straight and then put a little ponytail where you want it to be curly and then twist it like I just did. And now I'm going to take these clips and clip them in my hair to make it stay there. I'm actually going to use this kind of clip because the other ones weren't staying in my hair. So sometimes I have to use two of these to make it stay so if you need two to make it stay then that you can do that so now I'm just going to twist the other side the same way I did the first side and then I'm going to pin it up but now I am going to tell you if you want kind of small ringlets that are kind of a regular medium size, then you're going to just do two. But if you want it to be more like big sized curls, then you're going to make it all in one. And I can show you how to do just one. You just basically do what you just did. And then you're going to take one of the sides over to the other side. And then you're going to twist them over and keep doing that until you have a good sized curl that you want and I have done all of these so I know that all of these work how I'm saying um, but it sometimes it depends on what hair type you have so if you have straight I don't know if it's gonna work as good I have naturally wavy hair but my wavy is kind of crazy it is like ones like this and then ones like that and it's like ugh, it's crazy and so I usually do it like this 
but also you can also split it in four parts if you want like small curls like little tiny ringlets then you're going to split it up into four little parts and you're just going to twist like you did for the two but you're going to be doing it for four so it's really simple and really easy and also if you want it to look a little more presentable than that because I hate going around in my house like that because my mom always wants to take my picture and post it and I'm like no mom you're not doing that so another way is you can do a little Miley Cyrus buns in your hair you can just make you can just twist them into little twisty buns onto the side of your hair like that and I think that looks a little more presentable than that, but I think it dries a little faster if you do it the other way. So I would really say that you should do that one. But you can also blow dry it, but if you blow dry it, I would say you should do it with ponytail, ponytail holders instead. Like you should tie one down here at the bottom and then wherever your layers kind of come out, if you have layers, then I would say you should tie one around that area and around the very top so that your bangs don't fall out. So that is all and I will show you how my hair turns out after my hair is done drying. Okay, so now I'm going to take out the clips. And so for how you get the curls out, you will just take little strands from the back first or you can start with the front whichever way you want to and then you're just going to pull out each of the strands from the curls the top of my hair is still a little bit wet so I'm probably going to put mine back in it after this but I just wanted to show you what the bottom of mine looked like um, while they're dry so Here is how they are, and I think they're really cute and really pretty curls. I think they look just like the curls you can do with the wand, so I think these are perfect for lots of different occasions or if you're just going to school. So if you want to brush them out, brush them out with a comb because it will not take out all of your curls like a comb will. So and then don't brush them out with any kind of brush like I use a detangler the tangle teaser brush and you don't want to use this on it because it'll make your hair all frizzy and gross trust me I did it once not pretty um so I would definitely suggest you sleeping with your hair like that because it will be so much faster to you because you'll be sleeping so you won't notice that it's drying and like when you're sleeping you can take it out of the clips and just let them sit because they won't come out I've, I, I'm i kind of a crazy sleeper and I know that they don't come out because I've slept with them before and they don't come out so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more DIY videos like this then please subscribe to my channel and also follow all my social medias they will be linked down below and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time bye